If you put a lid on this, it just sort of takes away from the view that's here. Now, if you went one block further, you'd be too close to the hill. If you went one block too far back, I don't think you'd actually get the sparkling hills that you've actually got here. So what you end up with is some great sort of lighting, um, some beautiful people, and an enormous five and a half thousand square foot patio. You'd never know that you were standing in what used to be a parking lot just a few months ago before we opened. And the decor really reflects that. Everything from the olive trees that we've put in, there's nine of them, and they're each 100 years old. We craned them in, they came from Northern California. And just sort of seeing the visual of the lights coming through the trees and the leaves, it's beautiful. It's an amazing European garden. Tourism is probably our number one industry in West Hollywood with all these bars and nightclubs and hotels in a very two two mile dense radius. Um, our 2014 numbers had 1.4 million visitors and about 700 million in direct spending. So that is huge for us. It created about 5,500 additional jobs in tourism. And so it, we're thriving uh, in terms of hospitality industry here in West Hollywood. Typically, most steakhouse restaurants are dark wood, leather, mahogany. We wanted to create a steakhouse that really brought the Southern California elements in it. Uh, we had custom shutters made, we have a retractable roof, and it's a very large uh, patio with over 2,500 square feet.